It's process and procedure. Whatever way the customer is gonna mount that go-cater, it has to be perfect. Anywhere from 25 to 50 microns on three different datum points on the go-cater, where our quality team will either manually inspect it or it goes on one of the CMMs. We can set our parts up and we can have 50 different varieties running at any different time, even on one machine. We can put a part up and even shut it off for two, three, four, six months to a year, we can turn it on and we know that part's gonna run exactly the same based on the processes that we've kept. Mostly we take raw aluminum, cut it into blocks and machine it into very precise parts used by our headquarters. They go to our tumbling department and it makes a smooth finish, takes off all the machining marks. They get deburred and then they're sent out to anodizers, get turned mostly black and then it comes back to us for lasering. I am doing the laser, I think it's more than two years. Every time if we have new parts, I'm so excited to try the laser. We love it here at the machining group. We have a great group of people. Everyone just gets along so well. We do barbecues in the summertime, team building events, working together towards our common goal of making like, the best parts that we can. I feel free to learn as much as I want to and as much as interests me. And then I also feel like I'm in an environment with a team who feels the same way. We're all eager to learn new skills, new technology. We're a progressive group who are really generally interested in what we're doing. All kind of jobs in here, I like it because of co-workers. Anytime you need help, they are always there for you. That's why I think our whole company is so productive. I love my job. I love the people that I work with. We kind of get the best of both worlds, you know, working for a tech company, but also having that smaller shop feel. The last five years, we've had three new machines already. It's grown quite a bit. We had like one shelf of inventory that we kept, and now we have four. We got the robo drill. Now we can go faster and better quality. It allows us a really efficient operation where we can load a large amount of parts and have the machine process them unattended, but it's also very configurable so that it can respond to the different demands of orders. I never thought when I started here as a deburr that I would be planning the machines and managing a team. We love to transfer our knowledge. Give me your ideas, let's talk about it. Let's share information, let's grow everybody at the same time.